my name is Dolev and I'm from Vizimix company. In this tutorial, I will show you a new methodology using Vizimix software for the purpose of checking the influence of mixing in your process. We all know the scenario where your manager gives you a new project on a small batch of material that runs smoothly in the lab and then expects you to generate a large batch of material in a short period of time so that you can send it to your customer. It is very difficult to explain to your manager based on your experience that in all likelihood you will encounter a lot of problems when you're scaling up the chemical process. The question is, how can we avoid scale-up problems during the scale-up stages for the new chemical process? Whether you are a process chemist, an engineer or a technician, Visimix works with you at your level of expertise. As input, you need only a set of initial data available from routine sources the type and dimensions of your mixing system, and the properties of the media. If you don't know the exact values, Vizimix helps you to estimate them. You have thus entered all the basic initial data for your equipment and media and the diagram of your system corresponding to your input appears. At every stage in the life cycle of the process application, whether you are a chemist, design engineer, or process and control engineer, Vizimix saves you time and makes your work more efficient and less error prone. You may now proceed to calculations using the calculate option in Vizimix. As you can see, there are many parameters that are available in Vizimix to calculate. So which parameter is relevant for the project? Under the Vizimix menu help, you can find which parameters are recommended to keep fixed for your specific application. As you can see by clicking Vizimix, Help, Content, Selecting Equipment, Key Scaling Up Parameters for Different Unit Operations, you will find tables that describe the process, which parameter is important and where you can find this parameter. In this way, you are connecting now between the process, the hydrodynamics, and the results you have from the previous experience in the lab, previous manufacturing sites and pilot studies. Now I invite you to view the next section of this tutorial.